Okay, this is one of the only few custom rooms which is quite underrated. It's having all the Lineage OS features. It's an upgraded version of Lineage OS and it, it's finally also updated to Android 14. At least while making this video, official versions based on Android 14 are not rolled out yet. But unofficial versions are here for some of the other devices too. I've installed it on my device and we are just going to talk about some of the great features of LMO Droid Libre Mobile OS. The link is already available in the description for all the official supported devices so as soon as the official version will come you will be able to install it on your device some pixel devices are supported some xiaomi devices are supported a lot of other devices supports too so let's have a quick look at some of the pre-installed and default things here firstly it's an upgraded version of lineage os but it still brings you some useful things some interesting things like the default launcher is not reputed launcher it's launcher 3 which is available in some other custom rooms so have all the same kind of options available for you to customize or the features you can say some app drawer features are available here you also have the option for customizing the recent panel let me show you the recent panel too but if we move on to the miscellaneous options you have same kind of things app locker is not available in this case but it's available in settings we will talk about that later on this is the recent panel what we have so you can enable the clear all button and the screenshot button which is present here moving on to the quick settings panel if you saw my lineage 21 video the based on android 14 that was uh, the quick settings panel was in dark mode but in this case because we are using LMO Droid, it's based on Lineage OS, but it still brings you the light quick settings panel. So if you use a light mode, you will get the light quick settings panel. If you use a dark mode, you will get the dark quick settings panel. Else things are quite same. And also if you're able to notice the blur behind the quick settings panel, yes, you have the option to enable or disable this thing. We will talk about that later on too. One thing if you're able to notice here, we do not have the Google Play Store and Google Play services installed because most of the devices, you will not get the same kind of things like Lineage OS. You can install Google Apps on your own in case you want to and it also supports Micro G. So yes, if you want to install Micro G, you can use that. F-Droid is already pre-installed, which is a different thing. Lineage OS does not provide you this. F-Droid is pre-installed in this custom room and which is systemlessly already installed, which means if you install any app from there, it will not ask you any kind of confirmation. Install and after downloading, the app will be installed in the background like Google Play Store. One thing is the dialer. Yes, Lineage OS also has a different kind of dialer, which has a call recording option. But in this case, it's an upgraded version. So if you're able to notice this on screen or you can say in call UI, it looks so amazing. It reminds me of Octavio OS Dialer, although it's not exactly like that. But yes, the UI seems quite interesting and quite good. You have this kind of UI available in the Dialer. So yes, it's a replacement of Google Dialer, of course. We don't have the Google Play services installed. So it was kind of expected. If we move on to the other options, kind of same here. No customizations available in the Dialer settings, which was kind of expected too. One more thing is, if you move on to the settings UI, you will find the settings UI is also a bit changed as compared to Lineage OS. This settings UI is card style UI, also looks good. Material use theming is of course supported here in this case. And uh, to be very honest with you, the settings UI is looking better, minimal, good looking as compared to Lineage OS 21. But that's completely, that's completely fine. It's up to you if you like this one or not. If I move on to the security and privacy options, you will notice we have the fingerprint and face unlock support. In Lineage OS 21, you don't have that. You have the fingerprint unlock support, of course, but as far as I know, face unlock is not present in Lineage OS 21. I tried the official versions on two or three devices and face unlock was not present there. In screen lock options, you will find the quick settings option. As you can see, allow toggling quick settings on secure lock screen. So this is a very useful privacy feature. Not much we talk about it, but it's still quite good. So make sure to disable it. We have the option for auto reboot, which is available in some other custom rooms too. For example, Dubfest OS brings you this feature. Restrict USB feature is also present, which was present in Lineage OS 2, which is already available from a long time. So yes, you have the option to choose the USB options here. You also have the option for other kind like app locker, which I just mentioned some time ago in this video. That app locker is not present in the launcher 3 or basically the default launcher. But if you use the security and privacy options, you will find app locker. Although you can't hide the apps from the launcher without enabling the protection feature, which is a bit disappointing. But yes, if you use it, I have, I think so, you will love this thing. 
वन ऑफ माई फेवरेट थिंग्स अबाउट दिस थिंग दिस कस्टम होम इज द पैरल स्पेस ऑप्शन यू आर वंडरिंग वाई बिकॉज इन एंड्रॉयड फोर्टीन बेस कस्टम होम्स दिस फीचर इज ऑलरेडी इंक्लूडेड विच इज क्वाइट गुड बट दैट इज एप क्लोनिंग विच इज अ डिफरेंट थिंग एज कम्पेयर टू पैरल स्पेस इन पैरल स्पेस इट विल सिंपली क्रिएट अ न्यू इन्वायरमेंट सेपरेट इन्वायरमेंट थ्रू विच यू कैन क्लोन द एप्स एंड इन दिस केस अनलाइक एप क्लोनिंग वेर यू कैन क्लोन अ पर्टिकुलर एप ओनली वन टाइम ओनली वन इंस्टेंस इज पॉसिबल इन दैट केस बट इन दिस केस बिकॉज वी जस्ट इनेबल द पैरल स्पेस ऑप्शन सो आई एम एबल टू क्रिएट मल्टीपल क्लोन्स ऑफ द सेम एप्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई जस्ट इनेबल्ड दीज क्लोन्स ऑफ दीज एप्स हेयर विच इज़ अ पैरल स्पेस अवेलेबल इन सेटिंग्स बट वन थिंग लेट मी टेल यू इफ आई गो हेयर एंड मूव टू एप सेक्शन वन सेगेन ओपन पैरल स्पेस एंड इफ आई वॉन्ट क्रिएट एन अदर इंस्टेंस ऑफ द सेम काइंड ऑफ थिंग आई कैन क्रिएट दैट एंड आई विल बी एबल टू यूज मल्टीपल क्लोन्स ऑफ अ पर्टिकुलर एंड्रॉयड एप which is super good and unfortunately in a lot of android 14 based custom homes it's not possible because this thing is replaced by app cloning in my personal opinion i love this thing a lot but of course it's user specific if you also love this thing i think so you are going to love this and i'm not saying this is a unique thing because it's present in some other custom homes too but yes most of the times you will get app cloning Also in the wallpapers and style section, you will not find uh, the new lock screen clocks, which was also missing from Lineage OS 21. Although as I just mentioned at the starting of the video, this custom home is unofficial version, so a little bit of things might be changed. But as soon as the official version will come, you will notice the 99% of the things are same. So I don't think so. There will be any major changes because it's completely fine. It is completely same. you have same kind of theming options same kind of icon shape options which were present in lineage os2 so yes kind of okay okay it was expected here so these were some major or noticeable changes i just wanted to let you know labor mobile os also brings you this desktop mode and display settings and it's also available in some other custom homes but most of the custom homes are not having this thing it's originally available in this custom room by the way i never use that but i definitely use it some day and will let you know that how the things are going on other than else we have a, a bit of extra theming for example everywhere we have the option in apps we have the option for some gestures and one thing is uh, if you move on to the gestures section you will find swipe to screenshot which is of course not a big deal but because lineage os does not provides you and this is an upgraded version of lineage os custom room so yes this has to be mentioned so i just mentioned that else we have same kind of things available the quick settings background transparency the quick settings background blur which i just shown you at the starting of the video it is here which you can adjust according to you own, if according to your own preferences so this was all thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one until then have a nice day